I want you all to look at this question. It's from a concerned mom. She's concerned about her child's mysterious mucus. Every winter, my kids get sick and cough up gross, disgusting mucus. <coughs> I don't know whether to get antibiotics for them or not. And my question is, based on the color and the texture of the mucus, is there a way that you can tell how serious it is? <coughs> A lot of people ask this question. It's a valid question. Mucus, first of all, is composed of a lot of different things. It's got some water in it, carbs, proteins, lipids. It can vary from very clear to white, even gray, greenish, brownish, or black. Now, I'm going to cut to the chase and tell you, you can't just look at the color and say, oh, I know what this is. But it can mean some different things. And we actually need a couple of audience volunteers. Here's the important thing. You can't be afraid of a little mucus. So, any volunteers? We got lots of mucus volunteers here. How about, how about here? the two of you? Come on up here. <laughs> hey there. What's your name? I'm Chris. Chris? Hi, Chris. Hi. Dr. Horton? Faylin. All right, we're going to talk about different colors of mucus. But I need you two to embrace mucus in order for this experiment to work. You gotta love the mucus. In fact, look at this, Phelan. This mucus oh, is good. already starting oh. to So come ladies out. first. And ladies before gentlemen, that means, Phelan, you get to go first. And what I want you to do is go up into that nose and, uh, and show me what you find. OK. <laughs> here, here we go. <gasps> Achoo! Oh, it's like delivering a baby. Achoo! Oh, oh. oh gosh. Look My goodness. Oh, wow. <laughs> so, Phelan, how, what, what do you th how would you describe this mucus? Well. Other than gross. Uh, it's really yellow. Uh, and there's that. Yeah, I would, I would agree yellow to clear. I think that's a good description. And do you think this, this color of mucus uh, represents a problem? Is it normal? I would probably guess normal. Yeah, I would say I, I agree with you in general. It's normal to have this. Certain conditions, you're going to have more of this clear mucus, things like allergies, vasomotor rhinitis, normal mucus, but more of it. This is moving on the way from clear, though. This is a little off clear. And as you sort of move from purely clear, where you're thinking more about irritation and allergies, the darker and darker it gets, well, maybe there's some other processes going on. And so, Chris, this is where I need you to embrace the mucus. What's going on in that left nostril? All we right, need to know. Let's see. Help us out here. Oh, God. Chris's hand is too big. <laughs> oh, my God. What's coming? Oh, oh. oh wow. So All what, right, what do you have there? We have a color oh, change wow. here. We've gone from a clear yellow to a more green. What, yeah. What, do you think that's of concern? I, I would expect that's of some concern. Yeah, and, and what that represents is probably you have some sort of infection going on in your respiratory tract. It could be your sinuses. It could be elsewhere in the airway. Could be a bacterial infection. It could be a viral infection. But green is a... Definitely not normal. You see green. Although it does look good with your shirt. Hey, I you mean, see we green, like to color coordinate on this you're show. You're going to want to investigate a little more, maybe cultures, maybe some x-rays, that kind of thing.